Anyway, happy Sunday. So, we're currently 7 days, 49 minutes. Oh, sorry, 7 days, 8 hours, 49 minutes in this playthrough. When we last, lost, at last left off, we were in... Just had gone back to Dresden, because we just finished this stupid... What, the three... Three temple, three pillar or something section, which I don't remember running into doing during the lit run that I did, which was my first run, this is my second run, and God, that was stupid. <laughs> was so stupid. I hate going into fights, and the only way you can be really successful at it the first time is if you do research on the fight before you do the fight, which I'm not a fan of. You shouldn't have to do that. There's so many fights in the, in the Pathfinder games right now that are like that, is if you're not going to be successful with a lot of fights until you do research. You have to, you know, replay them multiple times in order to get it, which is kind of dumb. But, you know, it's I know it's the nature of these games sometimes, but it gets a little ridiculous after, you know, 20 or 30 years playing this type of stuff. Anyway, back at Dresden. A cast of characters. Gimpy the Arcanist, currently level 17. Everybody is. Little penalty because we're fatigued. He's level 16 Arcanist, level 1 cross blooded sorcerer. Why a cross blooded so why a cross blooded sorcerer? Because as the cross cross blooded sorcerer, you get to pick two bloodlines. He went uh, fire elemental, so you can convert all his energy spells damage stuff to fire. Meaning if it's cold, you can turn it to fire. If it's lightning, you can turn it to fire. Do that. And then we went Gold Dragon for the second line, because as a Gold Dragon, you get plus one damage per die of damage done um, for every fire attack. So all your energy attacks get converted to fire because you're fire elemental, and all your fire attacks get plus one to damage per die because Gold Dragon blood line, blah, blah, stuff. That's how that works. So that's why we did that. And it works out pretty well. However, we noticed... Uh, finally figured out what was going on with Gimpy's drop in damage is that his mythic path when we converted over to gold dragon because originally he was an Azada up to level seven mythic levels and we picked fire as our ascendant element well when we got converted over to the gold dragon I either screwed up or it didn't do it correctly and this was reset to nothing so his ascendant element is non-existent and as a result, anything that has fire resistance gets the full fire resistance against the spells he's using. So it's really cut down on his damage production. And so what we need to do is we need to respect him, <laughs> which means, yes, all 17 levels <laughs> plus the mythic stuff. And uh, we're going to have to do that today because this his, damage, his drop in damage is just stupid, stupid, stupid. So we're going to have to respect him after we do this, after we get started here. But anyway... There's Gimpy, the, our glorious leader. Okay, and then our story character is Sila. She is a lawful good human, paladin of Iomade. She is our tank. She does have a uh, Holy Avenger. Thanks to Radiance being a nice little upgrade. Radiance is a nice little magic sword that you fight, find at the very beginning of the game, and as you play it, it upgrades and upgrades and upgrades until you get to the point where it becomes what this thing basically is. And depending on the alignment of the person using it, affects what kind of weapon it is. So if it's a good person, like a paladin, it becomes a holy avenger. If it's an evil person, like, say, Staunton Vane, and who's been turned into an undead in the Lich Run, it's, a, it's an unholy avenger, or it's a something like that. Where it's basically the same sword, but it, instead of being doing holy damage, does unholy damage. But I probably did screw it up, but, you know, I'm not going to worry about it. We have to respect him, so it's got to be done. Anyway, and then we have four uh, mercenaries as our uh, rest of our party. We've got Rocket, our uh, Chaotic Neutral Shadow Shaman Knife Master. Shadow Shaman do sneak attack damage, and his main job is to... Uh, do melee sneak attack sneak attack damage with uh, daggers and stuff. That's why we picked up knife knife master because it makes the sneak attack damage go from d6 to d8. So that's a big jump in damage there. And he also helps out with buffs and uh, backup healing and of course his uh, hexes and stuff for debuffing creatures that we're fighting. Okay, and then we have Veronica, our lawful neutral human kineticist, who was originally a blood kineticist that unfortunately still had not been fixed. 
So she's sticking to kineticist for now. She's focused on water, earth, mud, cold, and ice. That sort of thing for now. Of course, her main thing is damage, but she can also do some backup healing when needed. Then we have Scout. Scout is a neutral good tiefling, Wind Whisperer, which is an oracle. Her main function is to heal the party, buff the party, and assist in with doing damage because she picked up dun, dun, dun. the Stormlord's Resolve, which is a converts all her energy damage into lightning or electricity. And then we gave her two rings, which give her more attack spells, either based on ice or fire. So she's got a pretty big arsenal for spells to use, and it all gets converted over lightning or electricity because of those bracers. Pretty effective. And then we have Mickey. Mickey is our lawful good Kitsune Deliverer. Is he tired too? I guess so. Um, basically, he just sits back with the longbow and kills stuff. That's his main job. Why is her strength so low? Because of fatigue. I'm wondering why she's that heavy down here. It's because the fatigue's killing her. But anyway, that's our cast of characters currently. Oh, sorry, forgot. MVP. <laughs> MVP is actually Rocket's pet. Because as a shaman, he went to his magic is basically based off of nature, and at level 16 he picked up this nice little pet, which is Smilodon. Black Smilodon, actually. And uh, the nice changes they made in this this version of Pathfinder is that uh, your, your creatures actually have inventory you can manage, and they also have feats and stuff that you can give them as they level up. So you get all that stuff. So, he's a, definitely an MVP. Definitely helping out. Okay, so, there's that. I guess I have coming back in here. Hello everyone. My name is Veronica and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. Mm. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Knee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yep, thank you for watching. Happy Sunday. Sorry, Gabe didn't like it that I all tapped out while it was loading. Okay, we're going to take a quick look around the streets here because um, in order to this quest, the missing scouts or something like that um, was related to a guy that was related to another, that was responsible for a quest that we were working with that we just got back from. Unfortunately, he didn't want to talk to us when out in the, in the wilderness, but if he's back here in town, he may actually want to talk to us. If he's here in town, he may not be here. I don't even remember where he's supposed to be. Hopefully he's here so we can talk to him, get that quest off the list. Okay, Okay, so we're looking for say sail cane or something like that. So it's S E I L S E I L K I N D or something like that. And I don't think he, I don't know if he's actually gonna be here. Arsenal, Maestro. So it doesn't look like he's here. Yeah, not super shocked. So he's not here. Oh well. Oh. oh, we actually have to go to the end to respec. So it's over here. Hey, Kanker, welcome back. Pub crawl? No. Hey, despair to welcome back. No, we have to respec gimpy gimpy is uh broken <laughs> his he's not doing as much damage with fire as he's supposed to be and that's because when we became uh the gold dragon it didn't i either didn't click click the right button or something got screwed up in the process and reasons 
So, we gotta talk to Hylor here. Let us press on. He's the one that's gonna lost respect, but first we're gonna save the game. Because bad things can happen. Okay. This is gonna be fun. I stand ready. So, first thing we need to do is check out his stuff. So we know he's gonna be Arcanist, cold blooded sorcerer. Uh Canis proficiency, so get that. Reservoir. Nethys is his god, so let's do that quick. Not that it meant it doesn't matter that Nethys is his god, it just helps us to remember stuff. Skill focus of persuasion. And he's a scholar arcane. This affects his skills and stuff. So, potent magic, that's an Arcan arcanist thing. During spells, swift consume. Yeah, we already knew that. That's part of his thing. Hard to kill. Rats is going to be picking this stuff up uh, through the mythic stuff. Spell penetration all the way. Yeah, yeah. So I think that's the big thing. Old subtype. What's this? Oh, that might be because of the spells he has on him. Mm -hmm. Okay, good there. Feats. So, spell penetration balls, of course. Spell focus. Oh, that's right, Meta Magic, Quicken, and Empower and Bolster. Bolster. Quicken. Now it's going to be interesting to see if it's how it affects this spell book and everything, when we respect, because it'll suck. Okay, and improved double immunities. I cannot hide. Is that one? Iron well. Although it's funny, it's, I don't think the iron well is going to be that big of a deal once he becomes a dragon, because be, he's already like immune to like so much stuff. Oh, I guess you got scribe schools too. Has that came has it been a thing? Okay. So again, the mythic path thing. It's a perfect body. He's immune to poison, disease, confusion, paralysis, and sleep. So that's what he is now. Perfect mind. Need to mind affecting spells, effects and spell resistance equal to that. So basically he doesn't need the iron well. <laughs> Cause it's gonna be immune to all the mind affecting stuff anyway, right? So we can actually use that for something else probably. Let's see what else is available. Okay, so we've got the bulk of the stuff here. I'm sure it'll be fine. Hi, Helor. I need good training. Okay, for the first few times, she'll train your fighter for free. And this is probably the last of the free. So, again, gimpy. Oh, this is going to be a little bit of fun. 
So, custom. I'm going to go find his portrait again. It's that one. So, so that's what he's supposed to look like, right? Okay, and then we're going to be an Arcanist. Just a regular one. And then he's a half elf. And then heritage. Oh shit. Um, what did I pick here for him? Oh, this is really the skill focus. This is where he's supposed to be arcane person. Skill focus arcane. That one. Right? <coughs> is that right? Skill focus arcana. No. no. Okay, so yeah, it's gotta be it. Okay, his background was. Uh, um, <laughs> did we do. What this one? Can't forgetting demons for your crusade army is kind of meh so far. Yeah. Uh, this is background. Create mm, arm proficiency stuff stuff. I can't. I don't remember what his actual background was. Saturday and Sunday, March 19th and 20 are the monthly giveaways for March. A $25 Steam gift card will be given away each day. You have to be a follower of the channel and present to win. Check with Gimpy if you have any questions about the giveaway. Thanks for watching. Yep, thanks for watching. And um, dun -dun -dun, giveaway is going to be happening in a few hours still. This? I, I thought I wrote. So I have a skill focus of. Oh, persuasion. So this is actually what he picked up. Persuasion there. And then here, this is where he did the. Uh, scholar. Arcane. Plus again, scribe spells as a bonus feat. And... Okay, yeah, that's right. Just being in Act 3 so far, so later it gets better, but so far I can get three kinds of demons, but I can't choose which one to get them randomly, making stacking them up. Oh yeah, it's just like the Zada thing. Well, the Zada, you get the... You get the um, Zadas, but it's three once a week. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not good. They 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 die so fast. Having because again they're such low numbers they die quickly. Okay, so I forgot to see what his stuff is. I'm pretty sure we max this out. And we picked up some charisma. I think we gave him some dexterity too. Might even drop his strength. I do that. Or do they do wisdom? I don't remember. Don't remember what I did for him. Thing is, as becomes a dragon, everything gets going to be boosted up to level 14 anyway. Or at 14 minimum, so we don't even have to do this. Let's see. 
demon as number of times leader rank, so you kind of get some, depending on what you get, but the good luck getting some of the ones you want deal is mad. Yeah, well, that's the way life is. Again, I guess this doesn't matter. It's not good. The Twitch Prime thing is somewhat like fitness center subscriptions. You sign up and it just gets auto renewed and you don't cancel it. Well, the Twitch, well, uh, the thing is, is it's not really. Um, it's it's permanently connected. I mean, as long as you have your Amazon Prime account attached to your Twitch account, it's fine. And as long as you're, you're have your prime account is good you know as long as it's updated you're paying for it and stuff it stays connected right not a problem the problem with the twitch prime or prime gaming stuff is using the subs on streamers and they don't remind you when it's ready to be renewed that's the issue, main issue with it otherwise prime gaming is fine because they actually do send you reminders and stuff um you know it's time to claim stuff you know like games and whatever but they don't tell you actually it's time to renew so, and again, they tell you when there's new stuff up, but they don't actually tell you when it's time to renew your sub to whatever streamer or that it's ready to be used again. They don't tell you that. Um, again, all these are getting boosted up to 14 no matter what. So it doesn't, yeah, this is all pointless, so to click and it has days remain at the bottom and then you can renew it and it allows you to be used. Yeah, no notif yeah. Yeah, there's no notification. That's the downside to it. Okay, so gimpy skills. Uh, persuasion. Okay. Hold. Magic device. Perception. He doesn't do nature and religion because that's Veronica's job. So I'm sure this would be fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so feats. Improved el elven immunities. We're supposed to get that. Yeah. Because this allows him to do more resistance to enchantment spells, gain an additional plus two bonus on saving throws against them. Additionally, the DC for his enchantment spells increased by one. So, yes. That's mainly for dispel. You avoid auto renew payments in general? Well, yeah, it depends on, you know, what it is. I mean, in this case, it's free. So, or at least it's tied into something you're already paying for. Right? Okay, Arcane Barrier, now was it this? Armored Mask. This makes his Mage Armor spell better. So, do that. You already had that, I know that. Uh, and then spells, so many spells. Enlarge, Expedious Retreat, Grease, Hurricane Bow, Mage Armor, Magic Missile. Use Person, Shield. Wonder if it's gonna put all his spells back in the spell book. God, I hope so. Even with your rent, you don't choose it open. <laughs> uh, and this is supposed to be Nethys. Good. And body type. Definitely skinny. Mostly pale. Face. Oh, you're supposed to be. Uh, where did we select sex? Because I think pretty sure this is female. Sit. A trivial task. Enemy near. Forwards! Calm down. Not dead yet. Someone else would make better use of this. 
think he's pragmatic, if I remember right. Anyway, appearance. Kind of male. <laughs> um... Face. Can't really see the face. Oh, that's a goofy face. Needs more bags under his eyes. Yeah, the female body? Uh, that's. He's half elf, so. I think. I don't know. Is that the female body or is it a male body? It is a female base. Okay, so where do you choose the actual? So where do you choose the sex? You spend too much. Okay, so okay, so where do you choose the sex then, other than on voices? More to the right. Left. <laughs> Ability scores. No. That. No. Skill focus. Ah, there we go. All the way. Okay, that's better. Thank you. No, you take are me welcome. Forever. Now, please stop talking to me. It is kind of creepy. No scars. I call her good. Hairstyle. Gimpy's supposed to be bald. Gimpy was a bald elf. Why is this hair white? Oh, I think I know what's going on here. It's I'm using the, the appearance mod, and I think it's throwing all this stuff in here. Gimpy is raising money for the National MS Society for the ninth year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yep, thank you. And... That's not red. It's kind of too red. It doesn't really change it too much, does it? Too dark. Yeah, we'll use that one. Okay, so that's Gimpy. Uh, clothes color. This is going to be the purple, if I remember right. Purple and purple. Got to match his uh, portrait. Maybe dark purple, maybe. So yeah, so that's going to matches uh portrait a little bit better. I'll go ahead. This will hurt. I can't remember, was that his thing or is it confident? I have no use for this. Their life ends here. A mere flesh wound. Beautiful. And off we go. We'll win this, one way or the other. No, I think that's Mickey actually does that. I'll all. need to review this spell later. I didn't even break a sweat. This will hurt! Huh. We will be victorious! We'll go pragmatic. Okay, so. Gimpy, the pianist. Enter. Okay, so. Kind of close. Kind of close. Actually, his eyes are 
kind of white, aren't they? Of course, it's not an option. That's definitely closer, though. Okay. Working to the really light blue. We'll do the light blue. Time's not waiting. Ta-da. Gimpy. Rebuilt. Started, at least. Someone else would make better use of this. Okay. Off we go. So the real question is, is going to remember, is it going to give him all his spellbook stuff back? Because he had a lot of spells memor in his spellbook. Um, burning hand, slain burst, don't care. Okay, other feats. Um, spell penetration, if it's not there yet. That up now. What kind of stuff? Um, he needs wood and flesh. It's more defense stuff. More spells. Uh, snowball. Intelligence is going to be so high. See those stats already? How are these up to 20 so far? Oh, his gear. His gear. That's what's doing that. Second level spells. Want. Scorching Ray, Mirror Image. <laughs> so, again, respecting because uh, he was broken when he became a gold dragon. Kind of broke stuff. And what else? <clears throat> Greater Spell Penetration, get that out of the way. Now this stuff I hardly ever use. He needs the consume spell class feature to consume magic as a swift action. Flame arc. Grab that. Flame on. No. Flame off. Flame off. Mm, you want blur. Burning arc, it's like burning arc. Continue on, so can of six. Battery blast. Fireball, of course. Actually, hey, it's first. Oops. You say oops quite often. I do. Do you need assistance? Oh, I'm good. Okay, so, more canist. Okay, so... Um, let's 
So we get the spell penetration stuff. Get there. So we'll take a uh, bolster next. Shadow Veil, let's just do Strike, the gains consume at 20% and a 5% bonus in stealth checks. Effect lasts a number of rounds equal to the charisma bonus. We didn't pick that up last time. Spell resistance. Shift consume. Now energy sealed. This is always nice to have, right? And yeah, go energy sealed. More level 3 spells. Protection from arrows communal. Mm -hmm. Let's do think. Okay, another stat. Oh look, more intelligence, more skill points. Four spells. Controlled fireball. Mention door. Okay. So I think we'll pick up our uh, sorcerer level just to get it out of the way. It's only getting one, so let's get it done. In this case, we're doing cross blooded. Oh, we still need spell focus evocation. Do I though? <laughs> I'm trying to remember, do I? Um, need empower and quicken. To quicken first. And then the bloodline. So the first bloodline we want is. Aren't your legs gold. getting stiff? You haven't moved in quite a while. Stretch, damn it, you ignorant meatbag. Go feet here. Uh, take the power spell feet. Okay. And then the second blood line we want uh, fire elemental. And level one spell for the sorcerer. Take uh, mage armor. Even though we already technically have it. I don't know what. Just didn't have to take it first level because I knew this was going to happen anyway. Anyway, so we're picking the bloodline so we can grow claws if we want. Um, this so energy damage we can all the energy damage we can convert over to fire. And with the gold, all fire damage does one more point of damage per dice. So. Okay, back to Arcanist. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, what do we want next? Four strike. Fire strike is nice to have. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it's not energy based. So that's nice to have. <clears throat> Level four spells, two of them. Greater invisibility. Protection from energy. Okay, so Rishalay so it's a rocket has it too. Let's do the fall flat greater for a little bit extra hit points, maybe. Level 10. More skill points. So, so we have skill focus, persuasion, did that already. Skull cane, spell penetration, got both of those. Spell focus, evocation. Let's grab that. 
Level 5 spells. Echo locations. Helpful. And fire sneak. Dun, dun, dun. So, look, more intelligence. Okay, so, hellfire rag. So, works as a flame. So, uh, spend two points. Half the damage is fire, the other half is unholy pet damage. We don't have our others oh, to burn any flame. So it catches on fire if they fail their saving throw. Make them burn. Okay, two more level five spells. I think we got angelic aspect before, I think. Do icy prism. It's evocation, so actually might not be a bad idea. Okay, level twelve. Okay, what else do we need? Let's make sure we get the meta magic that we have. So we're looking for quicken, bolster, and empower. So we have all those. Uh, improved Elven in immunity, which I'm pretty sure we got. Okay, we can just scroll down, can't we? How do you know what you have? I'm not telling us which ones we already have. Okay. Um, Scribe Scrolls already have, because we picked that up through the, his history. Iron Will, I think about skipping. Let's see. A mental focus is not going to need. Combat casting. Greater spell focus. Do evocation again. Okay, level six spells. We want chain lightning, greater dispel magic. So fourteen, thirteen. We're gonna write it. That's fourteen, I guess. Thirteen. Mm -hmm. Spend one point of that to increase the cash level of a spell. This is by two instead of one. Whenever the spell expands one point. Oh. You can grab that. Level six spells. Do, do, do. Fire rag. Ember has greater heroes, but Gimpy does not. Shiranko. Do Shiranko, because why not?
Okay. So let's got all the important stuff, I think. Spell focus. Does he get uh, a weapon focus? Like for rays and stuff? Not only know that stuff. Um, So, exotic weapon stuff is here, but weapon focus isn't. Oh, that's proficiency. That's not the same thing. Uh, What did I grab before? <laughs> I think this is where I picked up Iron Will. Maybe. No, we have been, we have been focused. That's what we want. We want raids. A lot of the spells he uses are ray based, so yes. Hello, everyone. Level 7 spells. My name is Veronica, and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way, you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Knee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yep, thank you for watching. And happy Sunday. That's a combo strike. Almost done. It's not taking as long as I thought it would. Look, more intelligence, more skill points. So, what else should you pick up? Um. Um, doesn't really matter, does it? It's trickery just for fun. So you can see. Every hit points you could do is level plus this charisma modifier and last for one minute per level or until it, they're gone. Each additional time per day, there can the number of characters in the green. You must be cheated. Okay, this is by one. Every hit points from this ability do not stack with themselves, but additional uses do cause the total number of temporary hit points in the duration to reset. So that would be currently. Charisma is approximately what? Four ish? So 20 extra hit points, roughly. Metro slide. Basically, it's a three-dimensional door. We can do the Hellfire Ray. Only power that's not subject to fire resistance. Good creatures take half. How much damage does it actually do? Oh, it's the same as the flame exploit, so not a lot of damage. 
We'll do dimension slot. He's needed that a couple of times. Mm. Spinic spray, because it's efficacy based, so it can turn people into dogs that way, maybe. Walk through space. This is just another dimension door, isn't it? Help her up a third free down the move action. or enchantment. Call person mass. I can do this too. How many people would we need to grow? I can grow Sila, uh, Mickey, Rocket technically too, but yeah, we'll take it. Uh oh, does Mrs. Keepy want to talk to me? No, not really? Okay. She just comes in here. She doesn't want to talk to me. Okay, so. Proof critical. Oh, there we go. So, proof critical with the rays. So you can blow stuff up better. Level 8. Greater angelic aspect. Is he going to need that as a dragon? That's the question. Probably not horrible. Protection from spells. Against spells and spell like abilities. 10 minutes per level. Well, see mantle first. Is he going to need Frightful Aspect as a drag? Because dragons cause fear, right? And that spell resistance, he's going to get all the stuff coming with that. Mind blank, this is a good thing to put on other people. Hold that ready, though. Maximum 25 per level. And it rains dexterity. Full erase. Okay, that's all the levels. We're not done yet. Okay, so first ascension. Uh which one do we pick? Close to yeah, we do that. I think close to the heavens. Makes a bolt of energy from the line target an ally or foe. Now used to charge and attacks with weapons from the command attacks with weapons deal an additional 2d6 points of holy damage on hit and count as good on purpose by mentioning that. Uh, the second mythic rank, these characters that uh, become close to these autos that live in Elysium gain resist electrical resist resistance 20 and plus 4 bonuses to saving throws mm -hmm. against mind effect stuff. We've used this one to use the heal and damage. Come on, you pansy. Get back in there and fight. Okay, so. Um, sentences. We want. During spells. We want. Spell penetration. Send an element. We want fire. That's the whole reason we're doing the respect because for whatever reason this got reset. So this makes it so that his fire stuff can't be resisted. Supposedly. Can only be prevented or reduced by energy resistance or energy immunities. So, fire. Uh, 
it. But the casting. Spells, so your spells last up to 24 hours if they normally were to last five minutes or more. Abundant casting, so it gets more fourth, uh, fourth, fifth, and sixth level spells. Greater abundance casting, so it's more seventh, eighth, and left seventh, eighth, and ninth level spells. And then he still needs to do the the bolster thing that reduces bolster down to no level increase. That's a mythic ability, I believe. Favorite matter magic. So uh, the spell level cost for use decreases by one. So we want. Bolster. And we're done. Now the question is, what does a spellbook look like? The spellbook looks like shit. So we lost all the spells that he learned. It's so crappy. It's so, so crappy. I have enough spells? No, I don't. No, I do not. I have to go buy them, actually. Gimpy is raising money for the National MS Society for the ninth year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yep, thank you. I talk more, but I'm distracted at the moment. <laughs> so, at least we have a bunch of these scrolls already. Those are old person scrolls? How do we have so many extras? Molten ore there is one we everybody wants. I'm never going to use resist assets. Let's go clean up some of those. This is communal stuff. Dun -dun. Scare. Oh no, not scare. Oh, good thing I didn't take sense vitals. I almost did. <coughs> Excuse me. I do not think oops means what you think it means. Oh, it does. Hey, you got Tsunami. I almost picked up Vanish, too. 
Okay, well, there's a few scroll spells at least. What am I missing? So I got those two. Make sure this comes off the right spell book. Oh, we don't need to actually. So magic missile. Uh, what? Uh, use person. Speedy retreat. Shield. I don't even remember what's what he had here. Snowball. Oh, actually, we need to meta magic stuff too. So, uh, magic missile becomes bolstered. That's that. That um, we need anything outside of this group? <laughs> I don't have. I forget all the level one spells I had that I don't use. Speech retreat's important. The mage armor, and that's. Do sorcerer that she built. It's magic missile. I don't even remember what else he was using. Oh, you know what I think it was? I think it was flame burst. Failure burst. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Level twos. So, we don't blur. You did it wrong. This is how you do it. Warg. Please excuse me. That was embarrassing. I meant to say. Jag. So, bolstered uh, Scorching Ray. Put that in there. Oops, that's the wrong one. That. Uh, He's got mirror image. Should get burning arc for a little bit of a small AE or oh glitter dust. Definitely want glitter dust. Now that as you have spent playing this, you're still not done. <laughs> All the hours I spent playing this. What do you mean by that one, Jaguar? This is my second playthrough. Character building forever. Well, I had to respec. Because he was got broken a little bit. So I had to start from level 1 and go through 17 levels of leveling up. And then another 8 levels for the mythic stuff too. I know you're messing with me. But I still have to explain what the hell I'm doing to people who don't understand. Okay, a little 3 spells. Uh, blank. Injection from arrows. I don't want a bolstered fireball. Dun, 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 dun. Should get resist communal energy. This is Scout's thing. Battery and blast. Haste. I will take. You can do haste. Don't really need to, but. Because we have the scrolls for it. Yeah, it can be battery blast. We'll do a meta magic of that one. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, level four, four. So false life greater, greater visibility, dimension door. Yeah, we'll do a bolster. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Jolt fireball. And 
the five. Um, make a location so I can see stuff. Angelic aspect. Didn't get the bigger one, did he? No. So I'll take that. We're actually going to be boosting some spells up here, like um, from here. We're going to do meta magic with Scorch Gray. Make it quicken and bolster. And that'll be a level 5 spell. Should have been a level 5 spell. Oh, actually, now it's a level 6. So I'll get that in there. So, oh, we can do, what's Empowered do? Empowered boosts it by two levels. Oops. Set those there. We don't have a space for it, though. Do we have a level 3 that would increase by 2? Oh, look, fireball. So, we do a bolstered, empowered fireball. Let's do. I'll do that on our bolstered fire snake. More spell slots. Okay, level six. Three. And that one. Nine. Hellfire or chain link? And this goes up to 15d6. So that's going to be. The oh, that goes up to 20. Let's go, you. So a bolstered chain link. It's that time again. Drink some water to keep that brain moist. Just did. Okay, level seven. We want a uh, nice body. Oh, we do have dinosaur bones. Rocket can do that one. Rocket can do this one. So we don't have to do these right away. Humble Strike. It's a nice one to have. We'll bolster that. Dun, dun, dun. So, bolster. Okay, so level 8. Seamount as a defensive spell. Level 9s, we don't have those yet. Damn it. I lost all my scrolls. All my spells that I had in the spell book. So lame. When you respec. She gave us all our scrolls back. But anyway. So mostly done there. Technically not. Okay, make sure that's turned on. That's making all his energy with fire. Got his wings on. Abilities, so that turned on. Get that off. Oh, we gotta put everything on buttons too. Um, flash. Breathing fire. Or holy fire, actually. Where's his other defensive thing? There it is. There. Best spell ever. Might. This is reservoir. 
that to boost its magic. It's flame arc. There's the burning flame. It's four strike. And shield that should be up here. Oh, there he is. Summon a spirit paladin that I forget exists. Fighting defensively, that should be always on. Actually, no. Dimensional slide, I think that's a thing. Just to heaven, that's for healing stuff, it's already there. Angels. So he still gets to summon a spirit paladin. Hmm. There's the trance that we still have access to, too. Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching me in here, too. So now they're there. So that does weaken and extend. So it says bolstered magic. So we can put that up there. Scorching Ray, we'll start that one up there. Firebomb. Right, last. <laughs> Link just in case. Controlled Firebomb. Oh, that was this fire thing you just over it. Overrode my mind. Because that turns off by itself magically from time to time, so we don't want that to happen. Wings never turn off. At least I don't think they do. Scorching Rang. This is Fire Snake. Got the spells. Eh, that'll keep us going for a while. Okay, so. Gear. Oh, he's still wearing all his stuff. That's good. Except for his staff. Is he using War Mage staff? Overcome spell resistance. Lethal Conductor. This does almost two touch attack rolls. Each force is his. Cast a spell with Force Descriptor. It deals two additional damage per dice rolled. And then with the Fiery Spell Weaver. Actually, I think that's the one he's supposed to be using. So we'll leave it there. So he's good. As far as everything else, not wearing any goggles. He's all set. Okay, Kimpy, what do your stats look like? So all the stats get boosted up to a minimum of 14, being a gold dragon. Intelligence up to 34. That and that. Okay. <laughs> finally. So actually, not finally, because now we have to go buy some uh, scrolls that he might be missing, because I know he's missing stuff. I just don't know what exactly. Luckily, we have somebody in town that sells scrolls. Idea what he needs. Mm 
not the Lunch Outfits. Blacksmith, Professor, Arcane Weaver, Jewelry Trader. I don't know. I think it might be the Weaver that has the spells. Or scrolls. I think. Okay, so all kinds of scrolls. House of Touch, your person screen name, a large person, experience tree, count all those. Hypnotism, acid arrow, don't really care about that too much. Displacement. Eh, he's okay without that. Or he has. Or he has all the protection stuff. Drill fireball he has. He has dimension door. Um, ice storm? Doesn't really need night ice storm when he's got fireballs and stuff. He does have a lightning bolt, but don't really need that. I don't think. Haste he doesn't have. Does he? Shoot. Tell if he knows it. Saturday and Sunday, March 19th and 20 are the monthly giveaways for March. A $25 Steam gift card will be given away each day. You have to be a follower of the channel and present to win. Check with Gimpy if you have any questions about the giveaway. Thanks for watching. Yep, thanks for watching. Happy Sunday. And again, uh, today's giveaway will be happening in a few more hours. Dragon's Wrath. So, should Gimpy buy one of these spells that he doesn't really need because we will turned into a gold dragon with the next mythic level. Uh, let's see. Foresight. It's level nine spell. We'll buy one of those though, so we'll have it ready to go. Hellfire ready. He did get that. Ice body he has. Uh, scroll of icy prison mass. Let me grab that. Iron body, what's this do? To living iron, which grants you several proper resistances, abilities, damage reduction 15, pyramid to blindness, critical hit, ability to score damage, disease, drowning, necrosity, poison, blah blah blah. And all that spells are attacks that affect your uh, physiology physiology or respiration because you have none. <laughs> uh Mind blank communal. Can you can do that? Can be. That up. Do my talk to. Enemies. 
nobody has that yet. Get all the plague storms. Don't care about polymorphs. Don't care about power words. Does it have any communal spells? I thought it did. Buy one just in case. I'm pretty sure Gibby had that already. Do we have? Because I think we had it in our inventory. A rift of ruin, a nice big pit for people to get sucked up into. Summon, 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 summon. Sunburst. It's all creature. Oh. Centered on your target point within long range. Done, all done. So, 17 grand worth of spells. Book selling, don't need that stuff. Don't need all those quarter staffs, don't need that. either. Okay, a little bit of money. Okay, give me. What do we just pick up? So apparently he didn't know the protection spell. Not good. Okay, I'm set. Okay. Um, let's see. We need to go up to uh, the Citadel. Rest. And the quest guy that we're supposed to be looking for isn't here. At least he's not showing up on the map. He might be here somewhere, but I don't think he is. Could be. <laughs> Uh-oh. Captain Odin. Commander, about to see you back uh, at the head of the military council. A decision is required of you more urgently than ever. Here's the situation. They don't have an army in the strictest sense, and the enemy is putting up much more of a fight than previously. Judging by the reports, the demons are relying less and less on the armies of their mortal servants and the power of the simple blades, and more and more on magic and dark sorceries. We must respond in kind by, bo kind by bolstering our forces with expert spellcasters. I'm prepared to send an order to Canabras at once, requesting the necessary reinforcements. I propose we support our army with uh, bardic magic. Bards learn all kinds of spells in their travels, and their songs can inspire our warriors and give them strength to fight. Sila. These demons know their vile magics, but I know something stronger than that. Power of the gods. We need more, some war priests in our army. 
Their spells will chase away the darkness and heal the wounded. Fragile. We do well to invite monks into our army. They have hardened their their heart have been hardened by a lifetime. Their training and even demonic corruption cannot harm them. Graybor. If you're in need of mages uh, versed in the art of killing, you should contact the Daggermark Poisoners Guild. Their alchemists are second to none when it comes to making deadly poisons or utilizing them in battle. More priests. So, uh, more priests. So, growth war priests capable of healing and powering their allies. All church guards are promoted to war priests. Cure of moderate wounds, can dispel, and war of courage. You already have some of these, uh, I don't know, what was it, the church guards. We have some of those. We've been recruiting them slowly but surely. Monks. All church guards become monks. We got a shield wall. So, we we'll go through assassins, agile and fast fighters. Church guards become assassins. Well, that seems appropriate. Sneak move. Can you know, can teleport to any unoccupied square inside of the movie. Poison strike. Penalty to their strength. Hmm. Church of assassins. Sure, makes sense. Or the bards. Or of superiority. Has a swift action. Our allied units within two squares gain plus two bonus to all ability scores for one, ability scores for one round. Or of caution. Plus four bonus to saving throws for one round. Onslaught. All units within two squares gain a plus three bonus to attack for one round. Or protection. AC for one round. Mm, bards are pretty strong with those, but it's only two. I like the idea of the war priest simply because they. It's uh, that time again. Drink some water to keep that brain and, moist. You know, the of courage isn't too bad. So, they get a plus four bonus saving throws against fear for one round at the start of each round. So, that's an automatic thing. I think we're gonna go with the war priests. It's always nice to have a little bit of extra healing. Excellent. Our fighters will need their spells, and their words of solace and support will be just as important too. To reach a soldier's heart, you need to eat the eat from the same pot and wear the same boots. No, I'm not sure what that expression. Okay, we'll send a letter to Navarus immediately, requesting a group of spellcasters to be sent to our aid. I'm certain they will arrive soon, Commander. Mm -hmm. Is that it? So what's this up here in the room? Everyone sees this up here, right? On the right hand side? I don't know what it is. I've never seen it before. And unfortunately I can't zoom in to see what it says. We don't know what that is. <laughs> Him. Oh, I think that's. Oh, I think this is the the spell casting, the spell buffs, uh, the auto casting. It is okay. It's my spell casting stuff. It's so tiny. It's not a bug. It's actually the mod that I use for. It's the the auto buff. I updated it this morning, and that wasn't there before. But it's that's what it is. It's so tiny I can't see it, but bigger. Set it. Enable in game UI. So there it is. That's it there.
So there, it's a little bit bigger now if I want to do it this way, but... Nah, we're not going to use that that way. I like using the, the way I do it. Can you cast from the in-game UI? What, using the mod? I think that's the point of that. Let's do that. Switch that and it should. Yep. So yeah, that's all you have to do. Is that, uh, is that a favorite? Maybe. And as you can record stuff, I think you can go and you can stomp it. So it's not too bad. Yeah, it's again, this was, I didn't even know this was part of it. <laughs> I told, I just, all I saw was a little thing on the, the edge of the screen when it was loading in. It's like, what the hell is that? It's so tiny. <laughs> but we'll leave it up there for now. Uh, not sure what happened there exactly, but anyway, let's see what's uh, going on here. It definitely makes it convenient because I, I normally have to hit Control F10, or is it? Yeah, I think it's Control F10 to open up the the UI screen and then select it from there and go from there. Pressing the buttons definitely makes it nicer. The problem is, of course, is um, well, that's not a problem, but um, I have to go in and make sure everything's working correctly too. But it's got a record button on it, so that's kind of cool. Sorceress Fortress. What the hell is this? Oh, this can be upgraded. It can be upgraded. That's what that little exclamation point means. What about you? This can't be upgraded, yeah. So. That can be upgraded. That one's not upgraded yet. already upgraded. So if all these that I would like to upgrade it, I need this one. But it needs more build it. Oh no, we can upgrade it right now. Yeah, we can do that. I'm going to upgrade this so that we can uh, put a summoning circle here so we can teleport directly here so we have to travel with the group. Okay, so that means... Teleportation circle. So we've got a citadel, watchtower, hospital, a supply center. Oh, we can shelter actually. So that we can rest there and not have to worry about corruption. Okay, so. Set there. Okay, map. We have to conquer all these areas. Army can move. Where's our army? Coming down here to fight those guys. So, these are our war priests. These are our new guys. Those ones. So I was thinking about getting sand clerics, but if we have the war priest, we'll be good with that. So now what we do need to do is make it so that we recruit more war priests every week. Mm 
Now we need to buy some resources, though. We want garrison for spellcasters. Is it here already? Already have it there, so we don't need it. Archery, stables. Okay, so archery, spellcaster, garrison, stables. Okay, so supply center, garrison, archer range, hospital. Mm -hmm. Looking for spaces where we can put in more the garrisons for the spellcasters so we get more of them each week. Not gonna look at too many more. Hospital, Citadel, Tower. Yeah. Okay, one more. Gimpy is raising money for the National MS Society for the ninth year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yep, thank you. Okay, so I kind of screwed that up. That's okay. Okay, let's get back to actually playing. <laughs> I haven't done anything really to progress today. Other than to get Gimpy uh, all set up. Or respect. So everything should be fixed for him at least. We're going to rest, get his all spells back. Or at least rememorized. And uh, from there... I know. Welcome back, Tiger. Almost time for the wrist break. It's like it was the respec of Gimpy had to be done because his damage reduction was non -ex almost non-existent because his mythic ability to ignore fire resistance was reset to nothing for whatever reason. I don't know why. I don't know if it was a mistake I made when he became Gold Dragon or it just got uh, reset because of a bug. You know, don't know. So he had to respec him. At least it didn't cost me any money. Well, actually, it did cost me money because we had to buy some more scrolls. Because, unfortunately, when you respect, you lose all your spellbook, which kind of sucks. At least there he is. So, little gold dragon wings and everything. Okay. Anything in here? No. This is Gimpy's job. Can they both do it at the same time? No, they can't both do it.
So these are all the ones we can currently do. So I guess this is... There we go. Okay, so manage. So we just want to see the arcane stuff. Oh, we can do legendary portion scrolls. Hmm. Chain lightnings are good. Do I do chain lightning? Actually, we should do race scrolls, I think. Taste, 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 where's haste? Did I go by haste, didn't even notice it. Wait. There it is. Here, make us some potions. Not enough to have a break now, uh, so I'm ready to help you with more crazy stun. I mean, experiments. What's on the agenda for today? We'll be standing on our heads, reading dirty limericks backward. I guess we must be talking about Nenio on that one. Note to self, it is possible the paladin girl has developed an addiction to participating in scientific experiments as a subject. I must study this phenomenon and include it as a separate entry in the encyclopedia. <laughs> Developed an addiction to participating in experiments. I think there are people that actually exist in the real world like that too. Okay. I'll go ahead. And this quest the missing scouts we can't do because the guy that we're supposed to talk to actually isn't on the streets. Okay, off we go. Oh, no recruitment. Guys, guys. So the war priest. Who would I want to replace the war priest in this group? No one, actually. Maybe the copper dragons. Hedge knights are useful. Speaking of hedge knights. Still don't know how to get these guys recruited. Which sure requires a certain building. Oh, I think we're still building that maybe. Anyway, so our main army. These are down here. Meet up on these guys. We basically have to kill everybody. All the different armies walk around so we can take everything. Forgotten secrets. So, ancient ruins says, it's a person from the unknown. Builders of the Earthfall times the Koreans dubbed this place the Forgotten Secrets. Scattered all over the walls of the ruins are numerous pressure plates, buttons, and levers, the purpose of which one can only guess. Secrets. Okay, so let's give something. down there. Nope. Okay, so fireball. Thanks. 
sorry. Let them come to us. Go again. Go paladins. Yeah, the dwarves, you hold there. Silver dragon, but you're on them. We need more silver dragons. We don't have nearly enough silver dragons. Go copper dragon. Get in there. Let's blast them with fire. Make sure they don't hurt anybody. <laughs> See, the dragons don't do a bunch of damage. I mean, the silver dragon's causing like fear and stuff, which is hurting their morale. And we're doing that too. Coppers can slow with these guys. The morale's at negative 20. <laughs> so that's what the silver dragon's doing to them. They probably want to run, but they got nowhere to go. Pretty, I think they're pretty much trapped where they are. There we go. No problem. Hello, Gimpy. It is time to take a break. Okay, Go so. check on the dogs. Baffin's demon spared no effort Your in breaking... Your next break is in two hours. ...in breaking the stones of the solid rock. It wasn't until after the Crusaders finished them off and examined the mountain that they finally realized the reason for the determination. There's a vein of mithril in these rocks. Uh, a rare and extremely valuable metal. Finance points increased by 300 per day. Okay, so. we can take a break. <laughs> Because it's been a busy two hours. Okay, be back shortly. Thank you very much for watching. Gonna get up, stretch my legs, get some water. If you've been watching the stream for any length of time, I suggest you do the same. Be back shortly. Enjoy the dog video.